Absolutely. Pocket picked initially, recovered by the Gutter Cats. Cohen into the lane and puts it in for the game's first two. Eddie and Cohen doing it early on for the perimeter. Hasn't been a whole much on the interior. McDuffie along two, step back, jumper goes down for McDuffie, his first points of the game. Allows a clean look for Eddie to get one going. Meanwhile, their side, McDuffie. Willis along two, rebound Gutter Cats and Cherry. In transition, here's Cohen spinning in the lane, reverse layup is good. Wow, what a play by Cohen. Nifty play underneath. Sandy Cohen, oh, I don't know about the Sandy Cohen first or second, but Sandy Cohen, a presence about him, a physical guy that knows how to play the game. High IQ, right place, right time. That's why he's had a couple dump off easy layups, and he gets the steal to generate the open floor here. Hines with the two-hand slam, and he's really shaking off the rest here in the second quarter. In, in dangerous territory, getting a technical of his own. Here we go. See right here, Hines, I talk about being a... A long three by McDuffie, it's good! Marcus McDuffie with a three! Crowd on its feet in Wichita, Rice, series of moves. Cohen down the baseline, tries to throw it down. It's caught on the other end by Cherry. Shot clock at five. Shot clock at six. Haynes Jones has it. Dickey, three to shoot. Dickey has to put it up. Puts it in! And he ties the game at 26. I'll tell you what. You got to believe in miracles. Because that heave from the 6'10 big who pumps the chest. That's more bravado than confidence. I can promise you that much. There are some things that they're not typically accustomed to happening here in the States that they endure while overseas. It's just part of the nature of the game. McDuffie puts in a three. His third three of the game. He has 11 points, and the lead is down to two. Naked down the floor. Woodard barely keeps it in bounds. Cross courts it. Kelly a three. Good! QJ Peterson back in the game with the ball, number 11, almost walked. Into Eddie's hands, and now Rice. Rice, that's a deep three. Book it for Rice. His second three of the game. He has 10 points. Grand Camp, Kelly, baseline, Willis, baseline shot. Yes! Back to back buckets by Willis, and the Aftershocks claim the lead by one. That was the fourth team foul of the Gutter Cats. Here's Woodard, one on one against Roll. Step back along two. Got it! Giving up nothing. How about Lockett working defensively right there? Taking away the angle. Grand Camp three. Puts it in. His second three of the game. He has 10 points in the aftershock. Similarly by one. And a whole lot of work here. Ton of dribbles. But just caught the defense on the screen. For and show. He does it. Grand Camp makes him pay. Grand Camp slips it inside to Dickey. He scores. Peterson around a screen, a three, got it! A three by Peterson, his third of the game. He has 11 points, and we are tied at 62. And the aftershocks continue to lag a little bit off, especially on a ball screen. Willis has to be up and hedge that thing off. Odiasi against Willis. 121 guards the other. Odiasi goes up strong, count the basket and one. A chance for a three-point play. Gutter Cats on a 6-0 run. Peterson down the lane. Shot blocked by the Aftershocks. Taken by Kelly. Two on three. Grand Camp. Kelly. Woodard. Three. Good! Line of defense says, get that stuff out of here. On the other side, Kelly swings. Woodard delivers. Willis down the lane. Scored the basket. And one. And a hit of the line for a free throw and the foot gets dragged, and it's a turnover. Woodard inside, McDuffie reverse, layup is good! Yeah, I see no let off in rust, and no fatigue settling in for the aftershocks. Oh, the LC two-hand slam, he throws it down, his ninth point of the game, and the lead is now down to two. Plus the lead in half, down to two. Aftershocks ball, four points away from the win, Willis, a three, good! Odiasi lost it, turns it over. Aftershocks have it. They can win it right here. Kelly, the layup is good. It's good by Woodard. And the Aftershocks are going to the semifinals of TBT.